these two guys. Ry Riley will talk on Twitter like he's toying around with other characters, but it's, it's, it's Didi. And Sassy, sticking with that Luigi, it's carried him to a number of tournament wins in this region over the summer. Right now, ooh, that's a big roll getting all the yeah. way past that. Unfortunate jab. situation. He got hit by the jab, but he was still behind him, so the rest of the jab didn't work. Oh, he tried to, he tried to double dip on him. He's trying to start this off big. Oh, He's wow. really trying to start it off big himself. There it is. Dude, why would you roll? <laughs> <laughs> that's the last thing you want to do. Big early kill coming out from Castilia. He's looking to keep things going versus Sassy right here. Do you remember when he played iModders and like he would swallow him at ledge and spit him out at ledge and iModders would immediately try and side B back in and get punished for it? Mm -hmm. Luigi is doing the same thing right now with air dodge. Like every time he gets swallowed, spit off state, he immediately tries to horizontal air dodge straight back to ledge and Castilia is just on top of it. And he's made a lot of damage out of that. Oh, Castilia is out. Oh, he's got him. Oh, he is pressuring him off stage. Does he have enough jumps? No, does not have enough options to get back to ledge, but he took 83 damage in the process of getting that stock back. So, but this is Luigi. Sassy Flygon shield right now. Too small to shield anything. Jumping right out of the space of that up air. Wow. Just gonna swat him away. Really high hitbox on that down tilt too there. Man, no. Just jump out right there. I gotta say, it's very impressive for Sa for Sassy the way he's playing because the first tournament or two he won, it was like everyone's getting zero to death, everyone's letting Luigi do Z air to grab and just falling for it. But like at this point in the tournament, at this point in the tournament scene, we all understand where he's at and we're not letting him get away with that anymore. And he is still pulling out a lot of W's and victories versus people, even without the zero to death being on the table against most people. Super smart tech coming out there from Sassy Flygon. He made sure he got hit by the left side of Bordo. Air dodge is straight from the ledge that time. He's flipped, but not killed. Yeah, D yeah. It's, it's DD, bro. You, it, it don't matter how bad he is. If he puts you on a ledge, you're going to have a bad time. Two stock coming out from Castilia. Handily at that. Only 62% on him. Straight back to PS2. Was, honestly, that one was definitely a lot more lopsided than we were expecting for the game one of this set. Absolutely. But he decides he has figured something out. He's going straight back, same stage. Okay. Yeah, we we all know. We all know at this point we're doing everything we can to not get grabbed by Luigi. So Sassy's gonna have to figure. Sassy's gonna have to figure out how to start these combos without the grab. Unless that happens. And Castilia is also a super good at SDI. Like, you will see his entire body move, both in the game and in real life. Nair to back air, and it just killed. That was incredibly early. He's got to not be happy with that. He also, was it this game or last game? But he definitely missed the free fire jump punch punish. But he made up for it right back. Right back in a two frame with the down angle four smash. Castilia recover a little high there. Nice up angle shield, but Castilia notices it doesn't swing. Nair, down air, Nair, down air. Ping! Catches that air dodge. SDI is important, but at the same time, just once you get out of the combo range, you can't just throw out a poor options on those air dodges. Those are going to get up B2. Right now, Sassy Flygon looking mm -hmm. to make lightning strike twice mm -hmm. with these combos. Mm -hmm. If he gets something, oh, gets oh he might be grab. dead. That's a down throw. Oh, he tried to miss for him. I'm positive that was a turnaround down B. But near to fire jump punch. Man, what a turnaround from game one to game two. So that's a one minute, 30 second match that just came out. 
So honestly, honestly, that's that shit was a commercial break. Yeah, that's 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 what high level ultimate is turning into. Is people know how to make the most out of their openings, and if you if you panic, if you mash out panic options to get out of the thing, out of the dangerous thing, it's just gonna make it worse. Cause everybody is laughing their characters to the point where like, okay, you air dodge away, all right, I got that covered. Okay, you you roll, you land tech away, okay, I got that covered. Like people have their tech down at this point. Oh, got the grab. How much is that? How much is that? Oh, he tried to jump out, but he couldn't jump out. 50. Air dodges away, so he's not going to get touch death. But. 0 to 120 with two very small resets. But it is DD, so it's still going to be incredibly hard to kill him. And now he is off stage. Now he is Luigi off stage against DDD. Oh, and that Gordo's there, but it runs out. Yeah, he lasted long enough off stage for the Gordo to disappear. That was very lucky for him. Very fortunate. Wow, grabbed him super far away. Oh, mm. Sucks him in. At the very, very top of the range for that down B to hit off the off the down throw. I can't believe he got that grab. Wow. Two double hits on the Gordos coming out right there. Big okay, out got the grab again. What's he gonna turn this into? Damage. He is not going anywhere off the SDI though. But he does escape with only 60%, 75 now on him. Ping! Oh. And the get-up attack somehow, DDD being so fat, it pushed him t through the Luigi. So he ended up being on the opposite side and didn't get the fire jump punch. And that Z-Air doing a lot of work for Luigi right now. Uh, Look that up a little while ago. That move stays out for like 70 frames. Like, it's incredibly active. It doesn't... It doesn't do a lot in terms of damage or knockback, but when you need something to just cover an option, like... Still, Riley got hit by only two of them, and it did 11 to him. It's not negligible damage. It's true. Ooh, but uh, gets the parry, gets the grab. Don't DI that in. Dead. Oh, he's not dead. Just barely survived. He DI'd the upper, right? Break it. <laughs> wow, where is DDD's shield damage? Please. I saw Luigi look at the screen. He was like, oh no. He angled his shield like so much just to make sure it wouldn't get poked. I thought it was just going to break. Here comes the jet hammer. That is going to poke He's going to take the damage. He is getting damaged right now. But I he think can't. that's worth it. 7% to close out that stock. Right now, he can't get grab comboed. Or he probably can, but not no. the big one. He, he, he's, he's, still, right he's still in the danger zone. He's still in the like, okay, one, one or two more hits. Maybe even now, down throw up B might be on the table. Ooh, or down throw. raw from the ground because you misspaced and landed in front of my face. What do you expect me to do? How are you going to land point blank front of Luigi? What did you think was going to happen? Sassy Flygon goes up 2-1 after a dominating game one coming out from Castelia. That's, oh. that's another thing that I really respect about Sassy is that like, it's when, like I noticed when in the beginning of the summer when we were having turns, he was winning, but he was pulling the trigger on a lot of these up B's and just whiffing, and just getting coin hit boxes all over the place, and it was just not going well for him. But like, it never stopped him. It never stopped him from going for it. He will throw out these side B's and down B's and up B's whenever he sees the opportunity for it. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't deter him at all. Once again, instant air dodge in. Still is ready on the punish, but he's gonna need a lot more than that already. 56%. Not enough to match the Stilia's 84. Oh, just, just misspaced just a tiny bit. Oh, that was clean. That was super clean to get under the Gordo with the gra with the dash grab. Locked him in place with the top of the screen Gordo. Wow, beat the sword with the invincible head. The Mushroom Kingdom of Smash coming in clutch again. That Gordo away, but oh, he was really he was grab. he was really hoping for that uh, fireball to hit the Gordo back into DDD. Wow, he fell so fast. He wanted off stage so badly. <laughs> Only took 37 from that grab combo. Immediately turned around, got the stock. When theirs collide, Luigi wins. But Stelia turns it around with that F tilt. Wow! I cannot believe he rolled all the way past that forward tilt. It's a big long roll right there. And he was cognizant enough to turn the fire jump punch around because he knew it was behind him. And how did that up air miss? But he's still comboing him. Still going. 
He oh, gave. He, you can't even be mad at this point. He gave him a chance. Nice tech. Big tech. And he keeps air dodging horizontal onto the stage. I can't tell if that's he's doing that because he's scared, or because he thinks it's his best oh, option. The wow. Fire sends him straight down into the bottom blast zone. Red splash. No tech zone possible. 